Hey, what's up again, guys? Bald Beard and Beefy here, and I'm gonna help you guys get bigger arms today. So, before we get started, guys, remember to subscribe, hit the thumb up, and hit that little bell icon that's gonna be probably right down here. Hit that so you don't miss any of my new videos. All right, guys, so bigger arms. Let's jump into this. So there are three muscles in your upper arm that you need to focus on. So tricep, that's number one. That takes up 55% of your arm. So if you're not working your tricep, you're missing out on more than half of your upper arm. So it's gonna be impossible to get big arms if you don't hit your triceps. Number two is, of course, your bicep. That is about 30% of your arm. And that is important as well because it's gonna give you the peak. And this is gonna be your tricep here, but this is gonna give you your peak. It's in your biceps. So you do need to focus on that, but what I really wanted to talk about is triceps. Because if you leave this out, you know, and you just have a bicep, your arms are gonna be a lot smaller. So then number three is your brachialis, which runs right down the middle here. That's not as important, that's only about 15% of your arm. So we're not gonna focus on that but important to hit your triceps to start with to isolate my tricep. All right, so overhead extensions. Um, you can just use any dumbbell here. I got a 20 right here. But you wanna at least do three sets of this with, you know, six to 12 reps. But if you're using lighter weight, you might have to go with more reps. So you're just gonna do these. Keep your elbow around the same position. You don't wanna move your elbow too much. This is strictly, you want the tension right here in your tricep. And that's actually gonna target your long head, which is the inside of your tricep. As you can see here, long head, short head. So this is going to really target your long head, which is going to give you the sweep right under here. So overhead extensions. Now once you do a few sets of these, you can do another isolating workout if you want, or you could move on to some heavier workouts. Um, you could use a easy bar, which I don't have, but then you'll be using both arms at the same time to do the extensions. That's gonna be heavier, it's gonna be more weight. So you can do those. Another awesome tricep exercise is gonna be dips. Now, if you don't have a dip machine, you can use like a bench. Uh, you can you can find different ways to do dips, but there's another great exercise. You know, once you get used to doing dips with just your body weight, adding extra weight is also going to be great. Now, there's there's different variations you can do with dips. Now. If you're straight up like this, that's really gonna target your triceps. But there's also a nice little way here to target your chest. Um, I'll go more into that on a later video, but um, if you simply just lean forward a little bit like this, that's gonna start targeting your chest. 
as well as your triceps. Also, check out the kicks. Nike Metcon 5s. They're pretty cool. Anyway, so you can also do close grip <clears throat> bench press, which is going to help target your triceps. And it's gonna be good for your short head. You don't wanna to go too close because that's gonna put a lot of strain on your wrists. So, I like to go right about shoulder width. So, on regular bench press, you're gonna be out here on close grip. It'll be about right here. And you can go closer if you go with lighter weight. But for now, I'm gonna stick with right here. So, so this will really help build your triceps because you're able to put a lot of tension and a lot of weight on your triceps right here that you can't really do with other tricep exercises. Now here, you don't have to go all the way down either because we're just focusing on triceps here. So, Right, guys so those are the main tricep workouts you're going to want to do there are definitely other things like uh, push downs if you got a cable machine you can do those so now we want to focus on biceps um, biceps are you know pretty simple because there's only a few different things you can do So you obviously have your dumbbell curls. Plenty of variations here. Um, I like to start. I like to start at the bottom like this, and then turn. So yeah, there's many variations of um, curls and bicep exercises you can do. But, so with a dumbbell, I really like this exercise because it locks your elbow in place. Um, so you just rest your elbow on your leg here. And as you can see, my arm is not moving. My arm is staying on this plane and simply putting all the tension right here on your bicep so you're not swinging the weight you're not using any other portion of your body to help you lift the weight all of the tension is going right on your bicep so this is a great bicep exercise So you can also do preacher curls. If you have a preacher machine, you will rest your arms on it like this. And kind of the same idea, you'll do your curls, but your elbows will stay locked in place. Also, uh, probably my favorite bicep exercise is just gonna be barbell curls. <laughs> regular barbell curls right here so take a straight bar grip it about shorter width that way 
your elbows aren't tweaked in any direction and it's a little easier on your wrists. So just straight up barbell curls. I find that this is going to build your biceps and your brachialis because it's heavier weight so you have to recruit extra muscles to do the exercises. And it's also good for your forearms because you're locked in that position. And your forearm has a lot of tension on it as well. All right guys, that's pretty much it for this video. It's gonna help you grow your arms. Mainly focus on your triceps. You cannot leave your triceps out. Um, you can do as many curls and bicep workouts as you want, but your arms are gonna be so much smaller if you don't focus on your triceps. So don't leave those out. But at the same time, you gotta do biceps as well or else you won't get that peak that you're looking for. So work your entire arm and that's gonna help you grow your arms. And one more thing, drink water, drink a lot of water because if you come in here dehydrated, your muscles are gonna be like raisins they're not gonna grow. You want your muscles to be like grapes. You want them to be full of water, completely hydrated. That way you can get a pump and you can grow. Thanks for watching guys. Bald, bearded, and beefy here. We'll see you in the next one.